What is going on Tron community? In today's video, we're going to be diving into how to swap into the USDD stablecoin using Uniswap as well as Curve Finance. Now the wallet we're going to be using in this tutorial is the MetaMask wallet. Now I'm not a huge fan of MetaMask. I only use it unless I have to, but for the sake of this tutorial, MetaMask is one of the most popular wallets in the world today. So I wanted to make this tutorial as accessible to as many people as possible. So let's get ready to dive into it right after this. Welcome back to the channel Tron community. I'm Mike the Investor. Now, what is the USDD stablecoin? Well, in simplest terms, it is a decentralized algorithmic stablecoin, which is pegged to the US dollar, but it was launched on the Tron blockchain. And it is completely backed by the Tron DAO reserve. And they are the ones completely responsible for keeping this stablecoin stable. Now, let's briefly just look at the abstract on the white paper just to go a little bit more into detail before we get into the how to on how to swap into the USDD stablecoin using Uniswap as well as Curve Finance. As we look at the USDD white paper, we can see that USDD is a cryptocurrency issued by the Tron DAO Reserve with a stable price and diverse use cases. Now it will have a built-in incentive mechanism and responsive monetary policy, which will allow USDD to self-stabilize against any price fluctuations and also help consolidate the value of USDD as a true settlement currency. Now, I just wanna move down briefly to the conclusion here, just to go a little bit more into detail of what we just read. Now, if you look right here, you're gonna see that as a decentralized stablecoin protocol, designed to complement existing fiat money and cryptocurrencies to transfer and store value. The USDD protocol adjusts the supply of USDD in response to changes in demand to stabilize its price and this is achieved using TRX, the governance token on the Tron blockchain that serves to absorb the USDD price volatility. So there we have it in a nutshell of what the USDD uh, stablecoin and protocol is and how it actually tends to keep uh, its sustainability at that $1, you know, stable price, right? And so now let's dive into the how to. How do you swap into to USDD using Uniswap and how do you swap into USDD using Curve Finance? Well, we're going to first start off with Uniswap first and then we're going to dive into Curve. Let's check it out. All right, so now we are on Uniswap and this is what the basic website looks like before you hit the launch app, which would take you over to the swap, which will look like this. Now, I have my MetaMask wallet already created, and I also have the proper funds that I'm gonna need for gas fees, as well as the token I plan to transfer already in my MetaMask. So you wanna make sure you have those three things already taken care of before looking to do this transfer. Now, we're gonna go ahead and hit connect wallet. I'm gonna hit my MetaMask. We're gonna hit next. And then we're going to hit the connect because if you haven't connected before, you do have to approve this smart contract. So we hit connect here. It is now connected. Now, as we go ahead and hit select token, you can do a couple things because USDD is already well known. It's going to populate for you without you putting in the token address. So USDD and you're going to see you can automatically go ahead and put it in. But let's say you just want to put in the token address, right? So what we're going to do, you can head over to CoinGecko. And you wanna hit on these three dots and you see you have the Tron, the BNB chain and you have the Ethereum chain. So we're gonna hit uh, copy here and we're gonna go back to the Uniswap, hit select token and then you're just gonna paste that in there. And you can see you can still import it the same way. So just in case it doesn't populate for you, you can do that. And you can also see it's importing it via CoinGecko. So we're gonna import. Yes, we're gonna import that. And what I'm going to do is switch over I have a little USDT tether in here. This is just a tutorial wallet here. And I'm gonna do $20 here. And now you can see that's gonna get me equivalent to about $19.95. And first and foremost, we have to allow the Uniswap protocol to use this. So this is another smart contract that we have to approve. So we're gonna go ahead and approve this. You're gonna see on the right side here, here's the transaction fee. We're gonna hit confirm. And this is why you wanna make sure you have whatever network you're using, make sure you have the proper fees uh, in your wallet. So that way you can make these transactions go through. And so right now it is pending here. Wait a couple seconds and it should be good to go. And we should see the swap uh, button highlight. 
And so here we can see confirm transaction. Should be confirmed here in a second on my end. There we go, approve USDT. You can view it on the blockchain and now the swap is highlighted. So I'm gonna hit swap and then we're gonna hit confirm swap. And then here you're gonna see as well uh, what the total amount is going to be. The max fee, $17.57. We're gonna hit confirm. We're gonna hit close. And now we're gonna wait for this transaction to go through, confirm transaction. And here you can see, I now have that $19.95, which will be $20 once the uh, you know price is automatically at that full $1 because we know it fluctuates with a few cents here and there. And so if I move over here, and let's say USDC, hit the max. You can see I have my total $19.95, which would give me about $19.96 here on the USDC stablecoin. Now, if you look at USDD, you can see here's the current price, which is right around a dollar here. And so here's the Uniswap. So I went on and showed you guys how to swap uh, for USDD using the USDT stablecoin into the USDD stablecoin. Now let's go over to Curve Finance. Now Curve Finance does look a little bit different and you do have to pay a little bit more attention because things are a little bit smaller. Now we're gonna hit Connect Wallet. We're gonna hit MetaMask. And remember I have to approve it because if it's the first time, we're gonna hit Connect. And now we are good to go. Now, when you're on Curve.Finance, this is how it's going to look. And I'm gonna show you how to get over to uh, the USDD stablecoin. Now, what you wanna do is go up to pools, click on pools, and right here on the search bar, type in USDD. And right here, you wanna click on this pool here. And it's automatically gonna take you to the buy and sell. So now what I'm gonna do is click my USDT because it's coming from my wallet. This is what I want to sell for the other potential cryptocurrency. So we wanna hit USDT. And you can see it automatically has my populated amount. And what we're gonna do is another $20 here. And I wanna get USDD. And then what we're gonna do is hit the sell option. So I hit sell. My MetaMask is gonna come up, $2.90, confirm. And here you can see it just approved. And so here's the actual gas fee as well to complete the transaction. So we're gonna hit confirm. And right here you can see it is going through on the blockchain as we speak. Not enough balance for swap is not available. You can see confirm transaction. And now if we head over to USDD, you're gonna see I now actually have that additional $20 in here. And that's why I said that because I thought I was going to do another transaction, I'm guessing. But you can see the transaction did actually go through because I only had about uh, a little under $20 when I did the transfer on Uniswap. And then I just did another $20 here on Curve. So here you can see the max balance, $39.93. So there you have it. That is how you swap into the USDD stablecoin using Uniswap as well as using Curve. Finance. And remember, we use the MetaMask wallet, but you can use pretty much any wallet that they accept, but it's just going to look maybe a little bit different or maybe an extra step, give or take. But it's going to be pretty much the same exact way that I showed you in today's video. Now, if you gain some value, most importantly, definitely smash the like button and also share this out as well with the community for those people that are looking to use the USDD stablecoin. They now know how to swap it into Uniswap as well as curve finance thanks for watching and i will see you on the next one